Okay, so this is episode 27 of Unranked Diamond, as every single support. Uh, we're kind of left with all Harling Gages apart from a Swain. We did a... The Maokai that, that I did last game would have been good into the Clista, but they switched, so that's good. Um, we have a couple of options here. I want something that can easily get onto her because she has a dash. So, like, I'm looking at a Pike, a Pantheon. Um, Galio, maybe, could be an option. I just don't know what they have. So, it's going to make my life a lot more difficult. I guess we can do a Pantheon game here early and maybe they'll think I'm not support. That's the only thing I can really think of here. I'm not even entirely sure what runes to go as support on Pantheon because it's just not played and is garbage and I have no idea why well, Riot has it on the recommendation list. But we'll wing it anyway. So quite a sim well, I'm more unfamiliar with Pantheon honestly than uh, the Maokai. So. And Pantheon has a, little, has a little bit more involved in terms of mechanics. So, yeah. I mean, we have a nice little point and click stun for like Master Yi, for example. That might even be Lulu Zig's bot lane. Nah, it's not going to be though, is it? It's going to be Zig's mid, which is quite unusual to see. Usually he's picked in the bot lane, but I think that's a Zig's mid. Otherwise, Alawi mid, because Zeri would have to go top. So we'll just see how this goes. So once again, my commentary here might be a little bit lacking just because of the inexperience I have on this champion. Um, well, I'll <laughs> give it a go. And some minor spoilers. Uh, we did just hit silver 2 from the last game. We got double promotion from silver 4 to silver 2. Um, so, you know, if we win all of our games now, then who knows, we might be able to skip from silver 2 to gold 4 if we're lucky. Uh, the, the likely thing would probably just be um, silver 1 though, we'll, we'll see. Uh, looking at play rates, that's a 29% win rate on Ari in 24 games. Well, I know who isn't smurfing this game then. That's a bit of a red flag. Um, the top lane Riven though, Riven God 69, 64% uh, win rate. She might be a bit more carry potential. Enemy mid lane and enemy top lane are duo. Um, Zeri took cleanse, which is kind of smart to help get out the stun. Um, nothing really too crazy here though. Yeah, nothing too crazy on, on either team, apart from maybe the Riven. Well, what are these? So Riot recommends this champion as uh, as support, but doesn't recommend support items. Bit weird. This is for the unranked diamond, right? Yep, this is unranked to diamond right now. I don't know what to do. So level one is the stun, right? It's the jump. Stun for one second. Deal damage. Okay, and then I can't remember how his passive thingy does. So the next attack strikes three times, dealing a bunch of damage. Okay, okay, okay. And then the Q is either a tap or a hold. If my passive is filled, then it does more damage. And then the E, you get some movement speed. Okay. Gosh. So W, Q, E, and then we're maxing Q, then E, then W apparently. So W we're actually maxing last. Okay. We'll just see how it goes. It'd be fine, right, guys? It'd be absolutely fine. Vayne is probably not the best person to go with a Pantheon. Ideally, it would be like a Draven or something, or a Samira, but... It'd be what it'd be. 
Kind of looking for like a level two kind of play here. Get them on the defensive here nice and early. So we've got lane priority. Use my Reddit Shield Charges on this next wave to get level two burst in. Okay, that hurts. Problem is I need to get my passive back up there. Damage gets reduced through units, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that was a bad ward. My bad. Whoa. Yeah, that Zeri overextended like crazy. I didn't want to tower dive it though because she had, it does have cleanse. If she didn't have cleanse, I probably would have flashed W'd that. Problem is we're kind of pushing in so much that I can't really jump onto anything here. Awesome, great. No, you, your shield doesn't block tower shots anymore. Right? That got changed a while ago, didn't it? Okay, that was some decent harassment there. She cleansed quite late there. Oh, it hit the turret. It's alright. Ah, uh, am I alright? Yeah, I'm alright. This with these pushing in there. Minion dematerialize on a jungle Shavana? Wait, what? She got wrong runes or something? Yeah, yeah. Ran out of mana. Alpha strike a good timing. I wanted the Shavana just to come to the brush. So it wasn't obvious when I was gonna W the E. Um anyway, we will probably want the Fanity, right? Do I even bother with boots? No. Nah. Just we just go damage, right? Throw damage at them. So how much damage does this get reduced? 50% damage reduction on units past the first one. Careful, Vayne. Shavana's on her way down. She's actually ending up with a little bit of a nice bait, but she's gonna, yeah, die for it. Just three, no, 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 no. You don't need to push this in. Just let it, no, no. What? Why? But she's now pushed in the lane. Bloody random jungle tags. Uh, thank you, Auntie Matt. Thank you for the whole year. Much appreciated. I guess we do it now. Sucks. Oh, you're really gonna? Okay. I don't have resources for this. Okay, apparently I do. Okay, all right. I mean, yeah, Pantheon broken, guys. 10 out of 10, recommend. Surrender. 
JK, don't do it. Alright, don't try this at home, kids, alright? I'm a trained professional. This wave really needs pushing in more. <laughs> um, I need like Ninja Tabby. Yeah. Okay. Panth going up in the tier list as well. Mm. No. Like, you know, I don't know if anyone's been watching the stream for maybe like about two years ago when I used to play a lot of AP Swain and I used to rate it higher just because no one knew how to play against it. So this is like the kind of same situation. Like, no one here is used to Pantheon support or the damage numbers or anything like that. So it's like, it's unfamiliar territory. Got ulti, so we can let to roam. This my vein is level. Okay, that sucks. That condemn wasn't helpful. Could have maybe have killed the Yi there if it wasn't for that condemn. Hmm. Sheesh. I'm gonna look for a kill. Interrupted her recall. Like I needed to go back. At least her recall's now linked with mine. She didn't go back. Interesting. Please be more careful than this. Thing is, if I die, I give 600 gold to somebody. I would like to ult bot, but Vayne's still not level 6. Enemy bot in a level 6. Oh, Zeri just bailed. That makes things a lot easier. And you want to do that again, Zeri? Never gonna get the support item done on mine. This fan keeps dying. Do you have a video on when to pick the different support items? Uh, I generally make support guides for more of the more relevant supports, so I give a lot of item advice in those guides. So if you play a lot of Nami, for example, I'd recommend checking out my Nami support guide. I talk about the items and stuff a lot. 
Hey Pika and hey everyone else who's just joined the stream. I hope everyone's doing alright. There's no way this works. What the hell? That's a lot of damage, but... Not really amounting to much. Riven's doing a really good job top. The only lane that's struggling right now is the Ari. This E is also going to be a problem. Oh god, Fane's going against the Yi here. Are you sure about this, buddy? Ah, she didn't. Wow. She got dash. Sorry, I played that quite well. She she dodged a couple of my keys. I don't want to try a Prowler's Claw. Let's do a Prowler's Claw. And then we'll do Umbral Glaive. Alright. Yeah, my vision on the map actually is really, really bad. Um, let's see if I can use my ulti somewhere. Gave an ally a big shutdown. She was zero seven at that point. How much did she get? She got eight hundred gold for my kill. Um. Okay. Pain got a double kill. What? What did she get? She killed them both. But what? What happened, bot? Eloise back in the game. Mm, I mean, I helped her. She's also now worth money, so if Riven kills her, she, she gets 300 gold as opposed to like 150 or something. So there's that too. Well, that flash on my Q, what the hell? Is that legal? Is that legal tender right there? What the hell is that? Luck or question mark? Good job. Did 
Definitely get this tier two. If you let it go, okay, it doesn't use your passive. Okay, cool. shove in any further than that. Really, really, really early in here, so we do need to be careful that um, we continue to take resources on the map. Otherwise... Uh oh Okay, good. Otherwise, uh, they'll get free farm mid from all the super creeps. Nice try. She was hella the overextended though. We kind of need to group up and take one of these tier 2 turrets. Oh, bollocks. Uh, Lily all For some reason, I thought you wouldn't be down them. My bad. Got my ulti to get back into the next fight, Dragon, in one minute. Alright, I'm going to be keeping a very close eye on this Zeri. This Seri caught everything right in lane, and now suddenly she's making like really pinpoint accurate dodges here. She might have turned them on like halfway through the game, thinking, "Oh my, okay, I can't get away without using my uh my handicap." It's very weird. All right, that's all ulti down. Oh, that ain't good. Well, are we still up there? Well, Ari, you got that right? Seriously? Okay. It's gonna say. You can use an execute at twenty percent. Ah, okay, thanks. Forgot about that. Right, we need to look at towards Baron. Yeah, Bane's right. Riven's fighting multiple people bot lane. Recalling. Uh, we can do Edge of Ant next. Oh, the smite at the end. <laughs> 
kind of funny. Guess I'll be the split pusher for the team. Hmm. How's Ari doing? She killed Zari. And as long as I can distract Ziggs down here, they should be able to take top. Ari should be top side there. She shouldn't have been here with me. Crap. You're losing the top lane fight. I'm not going to better do much more than that. Can we help here? It seems a bit cringe. Trying to be a bit annoying here with the Baron buff to slow the push in. They're definitely going to get the Tara though. Yeah, Satchel. Mm, no, I'm not interested in coming right now. I can maybe do it now though. Let's focus the Ziggs rather than the Zeri. Now oh, they haven't got wave clear. Can we end it? That's the question. We should be able to. We ran out of Baron buff. We can end, like... We don't have everyone here, we don't have Shivana or, or Ari here. Going in, are we? Very cool. Uh oh. <laughs> Catch. All right. Well, that worked. Better than I thought it would. That was uh. That wasn't too bad, was it? Not exactly the best AD carry to be linked up with a Pantheon. Um. Thought we made it work. Don't at me. Okay. Uh, what on a... The Riven God, sure. Why not? Just the name alone. 27 LP for that one. So yeah, if we win the next three games, it'll be really interesting to see if we get uh, to gold or not. Second... Nope, not quite. Third damage on my team. Damage is quite high. Ari's damage is quite low. Not too surprised that Ziggs kind of bullied Ari though. Especially early. Um, although that's saying that like Ziggs KDA was still 2-7 after all of that. But yeah, we're progressing all nicely. So we're getting, yes, we're getting closer towards the rel. We're getting closer towards it for sure. I'm going to have to do it at some point, I know. Um, but there's only, what, five champions left. 
five. I have to go.